In this video, I'm going to show you how to fix the issue where you're unable to download anything on your Windows 11 computer. So if you're having an issue downloading an application or a file to your computer, then there's actually a few different things we can do to fix this. So the first step is just to open up your internet browser and then click on the three vertical dots in the top right hand side, scroll all the way down to the bottom and click on settings. Then from the left navigation, click on downloads and next to location, you need to ensure this here is a valid file location. So what we're going to do is just click on this change button and you need to select the folder where you want to download all of your files to. So I'm just going to press my download on the left hand side. But you can basically select any of these folders where you want everything to be downloaded to and then go and press select folder. You also want to make sure that show downloads when they're done is turned on like this. And if you're using a different internet browser like Firefox or Microsoft Edge, then you basically need to do the same thing in those applications as well. And it's a similar kind of process. You just need to go over to the settings page and just ensure that your downloads folder is selected correctly. Now once you've done that, click on privacy and security from the left hand side, click on delete browsing data, and then make sure cookies and other site data is checked, make sure cached images and files is also ticked, and then go and press delete data. Now if it's still not working, head over to your start menu and just search for settings, and then click on the settings window. In the left hand side, click on system, scroll down and select storage, and then scroll down and make sure storage sense is turned on and enabled like this. Sometimes if you don't have enough space on your system then this could be the reason why you're unable to download certain things and then finally once you've done this you can close out of this window head back over to the start menu and just search for run and then in this run box we're going to type in wsreset.exe and hit enter and once you've followed all of these steps that should have now fixed the downloading issue if you did find this video helpful then let me know in the comments and i'll see you with the next